Hello there, this is Smith Welding and Restoration. I am your host, Adam Niffin. Stick around, see what's in the garage this week. Undercoated. We got this just about fit. You got to get that down there, cut around in a way. I don't know what the fuck they got on it today. Kind of pisses me off. This is supposed to be a panel I didn't have to worry about finishing. It needs blocked no matter what. But <sighs> so this is where I wanted to be yesterday. Basically, I'm pushing myself trying to get two days of work done in a day rough sometimes but uh, evoking the old moral of the story uh, we've got other jobs that are coming in and out it's awesome uh, cash flow is, is good to have and by the way this rambling is just kind of an extension of uh, this morning's shop ramblings, so it'll probably show up in the second part or whatever. Uh, this video isn't anything about anything in particular. Monte Carlo's coming along. It's it's only five o'clock, but I should put in. I should probably put in four or five more hours, and I'm not. I'm just tired, guys. Just tired. <sighs> we stitched together where the quarter panel up top was broke underneath the rear quarter glass window on the driver's side. Made that all more gooder. Um, Jeremy cleaned up the driver's side door today. <coughs> Leaf, we got two hours in yesterday, he got a pretty much a full day in today. I got a job I'm doing for barter for some pretty heavy duty yard cleaning. Um, we worked on that, we gotta get that out this week. Owner of the Mercedes called me up for the VIN. He's gonna call Stuttgart. Get that figured out. I'll get a video about the Mercedes put together sometime soon. It's gonna rain here again. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna get the yard mode this week, but. Heard nothing of rambling yet? Oh, tough shit. Here I am. Uh, Alright, so folks chime in to my channel. Good folks. Um, every now and again, Darren will poke up and say hey uh, yeah, some some really good guys out there that, that pop in and say hi or just watch some of the videos so forth <laughs> uh, some people are eh, you know whatever it's a video it's pretty cool other people are you know kind of behind what I'm doing and what I'm saying and seeing and doing and uh, you know whatever um, so there's some folks that get that get into it a little bit, and I thank you all for that for sure. Um, then you got people that watch, which 
I don't understand. I got at least one guy. He watches. But he hates everything he sees. And has no problem telling me so. Which is fine. But... If you don't like tuna... Why then, when you go to the grocery store, all you buy is tuna? Uh, if you don't like what I got to put up, what I've got to say, what I'm working on, or how I do my jobs... That's cool. But why in the hell are you still watching it? Um, whatever. It's very simple and like this, and I put this challenge out to everybody. And there's a couple of guys I really, really hope they take this challenge seriously, because I'd love to see what they're working on, what they're doing, and uh, instead of a, a profile picture and, and type messaging back and forth, to actually know and see the guys I'm, I'm, I'm dealing with. And that's uh, our buddy Mount Goat and Mr. Jesse Bear, as you see up on YouTube. And those are uh, Wallace and Ken. I'd love to see what you guys are working on and playing with. And we, we chat enough about these things. But, uh, you know... Darren put up a vid this morning that I watched. Go hit the record button. Don't take all your time editing and so forth and so on. My editing kind of sucks. My production value is kind of low. I'd like to do better. And as I learn better, I will do better. Till then, I got cars to work on. Uh, I'm lowbrow and coarse most of the time. Doesn't mean I'm ignorant or stupid. Which means I, I live a very simple line here. But the bigger moral of the story is if you're not producing something new, useful, or just otherwise going on hitting the record button, you don't have a lot of room to complain about what's on the YouTube. How do you? And if you don't like it, go check someone else out. I'm not some TV personality. I'm not some flashy dude. Oh, finally popped. Um, I'm just your average blue-collar fella making it happen. And I make it happen day in and day out. Sometimes we're strapped, sometimes we're fat. Um, new endeavor, less than two years old, specifically doing this, and I'm surviving. When you can boast the same accomplishment, tell me how much of a shithead I am. That's cool. Might even mean something to me. I might give a shit. But just complaining for the sake of complaining and not offering up a better way I haven't got any time for you or yours so enough of my rambling all you folks out there that are watching checking in sharing commenting thank you um, those of you who are giving me thumbs down shit tell me what you'd rather see and if you'd rather not see me find a different channel if you'd rather see different aspects of different projects or so forth, I'll be happy to oblige if I'm able. Uh, you know, I'm not going to be putting up any donkey shows or anything, but uh, if it pertains to cars, metal work, things like that, we'll do what we can. Um, I don't know, life's too short to get your panties in a bunch. Go out there, do something you love. Enjoy yourselves, folks. Have a good night.